Jesus Christ, Tommy. You're confessing to a shootout in a church. And I ain't even through the hard stuff yet. You know Wait, there's more? No, put your bowling bars till you're old and gray. Maybe. If you think you can make any of it stick. But then you'd never know about Murillo. Oh, he got you. Checkmate. Hey, fellas. Sorry to keep you waiting. My shift just started. What you having? Two lunch specials, please. And more coffee. You know what? Let's bring the whole pot. Damn. He really gonna need all that coffee. Right, we've come this far together. What kind of heat did you get from the church? It's a strange thing. Nothing really came of it all. Always figured Celieri paid off someone somewhere because it wasn't even in the papers. Really? They did a better cover up than most political scandals. Seven, eight months. The cops kept showing up at the bar just to remind us they were watching. And Frank caught wind that Morello was helping Galati get reelected, hoping he'd go after the Don. Well, I recovered some account books from Morello's offices. 33 was a pretty good year for him. Bastard knew we were bleeding out before we did. While we were busy keeping our heads down, he started moving in on our rackets. Quiet at first, a few trucks go missing. Uh, top burner has one too many highballs, drives off a bridge. One of our regular pickups suddenly closes up shop, moves upstate. Oh, they're losing on. business. Not me. I think maybe Polly smelled something. But even with the cops looking over our shoulders and Morello circling, we were still making good money. And with the Dom worried about keeping the heat off, we didn't have much to do, except drink. Have a few laughs. Every time I went into Celieri's, there was Sarah. Good old Sarah. Your boo thing, right? So it was a good year. Until Frank. A Coletti, a dance can sit there. Yeah, that's right. He set me straight. Oh, no. He set us all straight. Oh, no. There's a lot of buzz around town about you guys. Yeah, we got into a little scrap last night. It's no big deal. I don't care about the bar fight, Tom. I care how it looks when you walk into a club and buy everyone around. Uh, we gotta do something with her, though. Then blow it at the track on Sunday. Or take a dame to a show. Or invest it, for Christ's sake. <laughs> you want me to become one of those Wall Street boys? <laughs> don't sass me, Tommy. I'm trying to teach you the ropes so you don't get strangled by them. He you wants you to learn to how to spend care. it well and wisely. Lit when I was a kid. When I was eight or nine, before I came over from Sicily, I had this beautiful skinny Tirneco de Letna. Like a little greyhound. Fastest dog you've ever seen. That's how I met the Don. We started setting up races together. Betting on her with coins and rifle shells. There wasn't another dog that could catch her. She never lost. Until the day she did. Oh no. We were the dog! Life, but the dog! I never saw the dawn so angry. Always with the dog! Old, you? No. Pregnant. Oh, she's a whore. She went to heat, got out of the yard. And every dog in town had a turn. She was gangbanged you doggy style? Dog, Tommy. Damn. Every time you flash your money around, you're a bitch in heat. And everyone in that club is now looking to fuck you. Wow, that's a horrible metaphor. How do you Once feel you about that? Fucked, you're no good to us. Wow, Tommy. You want to be a bitch whore like a dog? Do you understand. Because I don't. Uh, you made your point. Damn. Good. Because you need to think about your career here. Look, Paulie's at his ceiling. He's the guy we want in a tussle, but he's not smart enough to run anything. So Sand he's muscle. Loyal, but he has no vision. Another muscle. But you, Tommy. You have potential. You run this town someday. So stop being a little whore. Well, I appreciate that, Frank. So, uh, what happened to the dog? The Don tried to drown her. Oh! <gasps> I broke his nose. As you should. Wow, he tried. He tried to kill the dog for being a hoe. But but Frank said no, you not in front of my best, salad. Wait, what? 
How he know you and Sarah have a thing? Back then, everything went through Frank. The plans, the orders, the money. You could get the call day or night. Ah, Tommy. Frank says to wait for him in the garage out in the back, eh? You got the job, I think. Thanks, Luigi. Sarah's cooking. She's bringing something over. Is this rain? <laughs> She's a good girl. I'll see you tomorrow, Luigi. This is Lover of Ladies. Like my video. Share my video. Leave your comments below because I just love talking to you guys. But most importantly, please subscribe to my channel. That way you can get daily gaming content from me. And hit the notification button as well. So you know when my videos upload. Back in the day, when the boss was still with that phone, we got called out to a hit. Some uh, politician, I think. So a job this late must be some serious job. And that car looks nice, too. I'm not gonna lie. That blue color? Oh, Frank. The man of the hour. Thanks for waiting, Tom. The Don and I had to go over last month's numbers again. Sure. So what's the job? I want you to help Sam and Polly with the shipment we've got coming in tonight. The good stuff? Straight from Canada. Where do you need me? Sam's gone to meet our friends from the north at the farm outside of town. Polly will oversee the trucks bringing the shipment into the city. But I want you to go with him. Be an extra pair of eyes. Make sure it all goes smoothly. Okay. Get the car from Ralphie. Can meet Paulie at the warehouse. He's got heaters in case you run into any trouble. Sure, Frank. No problem. Good. Now bring the Canadian home safe, Tommy. There is already a case earmarked for the Don. All right, some Canadian business. I can't wait. Hold on. Drive to the warehouse, okay? This is Mama Motors, yours. If you want it, Tommy. Thanks, Thank Ralph. you, Ralphie. Working You're the best. I says to sleep when for, for Frank sleeps. Man, he's been w working us hard. Morello's taking bites out of business everywhere else, Ralph. Booze records where we shine. We gotta stay ahead someplace. Ah, well, I, I just f f f fixed the cars that time. I changed the p p plates again. Uh, you can't be too careful. That's a beauty. Let's see you in the morning. Okay. I appreciate you, Ralphie. I really do. You're the best. Damn, this is a beautiful car. If I had all the money in the world, I would buy this one. That way, me and the missus... The heavens have opened, folks, and we're experiencing some adverse effects across the municipal area. Uh-huh. storm front not expected to arrive for several days hit lost heaven late this afternoon releasing a deluge of rainfall on the city if you've been out in the last couple of hours you don't need me to tell you there are reports coming in of a number of traffic accidents attributed to the downfall with fender benders occurring in oakwood and chinatown a more serious accident has occurred near the white harbor hotel which is causing traffic to back up on the east partial bridge all the way into downtown the police department is attending incidents as they can, but they've now issued advice that people should not venture out on the roads unless their journey is strictly necessary. Well, look at me. Look at me outside because my journey is necessary. And yet I'm out here in the rain. to the problems we've been hearing of on the road air traffic in and out of the city has been suspended by order of the look at that guy he almost got run over all scheduled flights departing long heaven international have been grounded and those scheduled to arrive into that airport car accident so many cops this is crazy now, as bad as that may sound the latest report from the weather service that i've just been handed states that although the rain is heavy at this moment and that all warnings should be heated. 
The storm isn't expected to last all that long. Certainly, it doesn't seem like it will be anything like the big one of 1927. High winds are pushing the storm over us at quite a rate. We will, of course, keep you informed with news on the hour. But before I return you to our musical programming, let me reiterate that the Lost Heaven Police Department strongly advises against motor travel at this time. And on a personal note, I advise staying with your family, friends, or loved ones and waiting out this dreadful storm and the warmth of the home. That's all for now. Some music will be along shortly, and I'll be back to check in with you later. Thank you for listening. Aw, that's so cute. I like the video hose. That's pretty nice. But honestly, he says to stay inside, and yet look where I'm at. I'm actually outside doing the work. Oh my goodness. This better be a really good job for me to risk my life in this rain, because... You know the cars of yesteryears. I bet they can't really stand the wither the weather conditions of snow, sleet, hail, and rain. So, what am I doing out here, right? Oh, wrong bullets. Sorry. I accidentally pressed a button. I would be one to accidentally press a button. Anyways. Let's go, let's go. We're not giving up. All right, can I chill? Can I just leave? He's gone. Go back to patrols. We'll get him next time. All right, so I'm right at the warehouse, right? <clears throat> Is this how fast I can actually walk? That's pretty corny. I'm so used to just dashing away, but whatever. Hey, I'm here. What's up? Come on, Tom. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. I'm coming. Hey, hey. Watch it, pal. Just try it out. Say. You know this place? Uh yeah. We've done a few pickups at the farm before. Don't worry. There ain't nothing but cow shit and shine out here. It's gonna be an easy few clams. Boys will load up the trucks, and we'll come straight back. Yeah, let's make it quick. I got some place to be. Ah, uh, you see it sooner or later. Luigi's little girl, your night shift. Hey, yo. <laughs> You're something else, pal. Protecting the girl's virginity one day and taking it the next. Don't talk Lay to... Off, boy. Don't talk about her like that, man. I'm just kidding. She's a good girl. You settle down, she'll straighten you right out. Question is, does he want to settle down? Because <laughs> that look in his face. She could tell her about her old man, though. He was a stone cold killer back in the day. What? I wouldn't know. You know she's been helping out behind the bar since she was a kid. But yeah. She's even heard a few things. Probably knows more about our business than we do. She knows enough not to ask me too many questions. That's good. She won't ever make a liar out of you. Christ. You ought to marry her just for that. God damn it. Sam should be waiting here, but I don't see him. Where is he? Something smells off. Don't let your Pekka get all shriveled up. Probably just trying to get out of the rain. Or into the bootleg. <laughs> Chill. <laughs> He's still not there. He ain't coming. Okay. Let's go find him. I hope Sam's okay. What if someone that killed him? It's just three sheets, and I'm wrecking a new suit for nothing. I swear I'm gonna kill him. Here, 
Just in case Frank was right. Wait, Frank was Let's right about what? Boys, get them sorted out. You go ahead, see what's what. We'll catch up with you. Um, so I'm all here by myself, right? Oh no, the guys are over there. But I'm over here exploring by myself. Trying to figure out, ooey, okay. Trying to figure out where the hell Sam went. Someone's been waiting here tonight. One quarter out of work. But then again, look at the date. February 2nd, 1933. We are literally going through the Great Depression. So of course, 25% of the population has no job. It makes total sense. The Great Depression was one of the worst recessions we ever had as a country. What's this? Gave me pay to keep this place in check. Don't even pretend to find her. Okay. I'm just following the clues right here. See if anything is off. Hello? This don't feel right. Missing farmer found dead. Uh, Harry Smith, missing for two months, was confirmed dead today by the Lost Haven County Coroner Office. A fruitless search led by the farmer's father and neighbors ended several weeks ago. The grisly discovery of the body was made by local children <gasps> looking for edible mushrooms and berries in Woodland Local to Corpse Farm. The death is not being treated as suspicious due to how Mr. Smith's body was found. Hanging by the neck, he is survived by his elderly father. What kind of guy shoots a dog? Oh no, the dog! Oh, the dog is dead! What kind of a sicko would do that to a dog? Ooh, a cigarette card. That's cool. Uh, still no sign of Sam, though. Oh my god. I hope this is not no jump scare. I'm not really in the mood for... for any scares. And the music is really not playing. So the truck is here, but hey, buddy. he's dead. Jesus. He's dead. Well, your weapon. Whoa. You're first. We don't have time for this. Sorry, pal. Guess we're doing this the hard way. Okay then. Get over here! I got a pin down. What the hell? This is horrible. I don't even like this. Was this a trap the whole time? Come on. I think I walked into a trap. Because this is crazy. Alright, let me switch my weapons. Bye. Come on. Thank you. Is there another one? Wow, that was quick. Yeah, he's dead. Wow! It's me, Tom. Polly, what took you so long? Look for Sammy. Did you find him? No. Just him. Canadian crew. Dollars to donuts, the rest of the face down in the dirt, too. Oh, Christ. What? They're cops, right? They're cops, Tommy. Well, how would I know? They didn't show a badge. God, they 
didn't say anything. It must be in Morello's pocket. This bastard. He can't even let us have this one racket. That doesn't explain where Sam is. Tom. We gotta find Sam and get out of here. Wow, now I'm a cop killer. That's crazy. This is insane. These guys are the real deal. They gotta be cops from the border patrol. Fuck. They've come heavy, all right. Make lost having PD look like pussy cats. This is horrible. Oh, Polly, Polly! The fact that we can't even find Sam still. Seriously. Where the hell is him? He's not even here. Polly, why are you over there, bro? Come on, let's go. Why are you so calm and nonchalant? Okay, we search the farm, find Sam, we get the hell out. Anyone else? We slip him the bump. Get it? Yeah, I got it. I don't know. Something is so off. Like, where the hell is Sam? And number two, Sam! why Sam! why didn't Sam warn us that there was a potential ambush? Oh my god, look at the blood! Oh my gosh, the blood! <gasps> no. You don't want to see this. Jesus. Looks like we found the Canadians. You see Sam in there? No. <sighs> Let's go. Some... Sam? Nah, this ain't it. That's a Canadian. Wow. Okay. So the Canadians are dead, but where is Sam? We need to find out where Sam is. Come here. Woo! Anyways. Anyways, Sam, are you in here? Sam. George, I have it on good authority that Salary's whiskey handovers tonight. Our mutual friend wants this line of Canadian booze coming into the city shut down. I want you and your men at the farm we discussed by 9 p.m. Wait through the night and tell the boys it's fine if things get rough. They can take some hooch home to thank them for coming so far south. Yeah. Good oh hunting. Sorry, my bad. Okay. Okay. Alright, here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do. You ready? Let's leave. Wait, what's this? Another one. Ooh, detective. Sweet. All right, let's go this way right here. This is horrible. We still haven't found Sam yet. I really wish, I really hope he's alive. Sam? Come here. Come here. Anyways. Wow, the Canadian is dead. Let me get more ammo, please. Thank you. 
All right, let's go. <gasps> Sam! Shit! Bye. Come on, come on. Come on, pull up. Come on, thank you. Let me switch my weapon here. Bye. Oh, shit. Oh, that's cute. There you go. You're dead. Aren't you gonna die? Damn. Anyways, come on, pull up. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm dead. Great balls of fire. That's how I died. Look at me dying slow-mo, too, just like GTA. Yes, let's go. Let's, uh, let's start. Anyways, I am. Bye. 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 No, you're not. Oh, and he got burned. That is so funny. Come on. Thank you. Come on. Got you. Got you. Oh, shit. Woo! Move! Oh, shit. Come on. Come on. Bye. Woo! They can't shoot for shit. There you go. Come on, come on. There you go. Come on. Thank you. Are we done? Woo! This is really intense. Okay, cool. Finally. Let's go. Come on. Christ. We gotta get to him. Sam! Boys, stay here and watch our backs. Plug anyone who gets within a hundred yards. Except us. Sam. I see the dirt, but no Sam. Hey, Polly. There you are, Sam. Sammy. Jesus, what have they done to you? I got clipped. Christ, that's a lot of blood. Can you walk? No, no I don't think so. Okay, 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 just hang on. I'll go get the truck, then we'll take you to the doctor. Hey, hey, you're gonna make it, Sam. Yep, Tommy, exactly. Stay here with him. I'll be back, I'll be back in a flash. Okay. Sam. I know it hurts. Stay with me, Sam. Please stay with me. I need you. Okay, Sam. We survived worse. You sure? You sure we have? Oh no! Who the hell is coming? Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next week.